it's Saturday morning and I'm just heading to pick up my friend Melissa because we are going to Saratoga which is like where they have the horse races um, it's a little bit upstate so I'm so excited I'm just wearing comfy clothes to drive there because it's like a two and a half hour drive but um, I have like a cute outfit to wear when we get there so I'm excited about that and then I think we're gonna stick around the town we might go up to Lake George I'm not sure yet it just kind of depends on timing because I do have to be at work tomorrow but I'm so excited I'm really excited mm. I have not been up there in years so I'm really pumped to go check it out I haven't been up there probably in like five years so and last time I went was just for a concert I didn't go to the racetrack because it wasn't open yet. But I'm heading to go get her right now. fun yesterday it was such a great day we bet on some horses and went up to Lake George and walked around and it was so nice Saratoga is so beautiful and the races are so much fun to go to but they do end Labor Day weekend so there's that I'm currently in Long Island I'm actually going through the toll booth to go into Long Beach to meet my friend Caitlin because we're gonna go to the beach and just have ourselves like a relaxing Sunday at Carvel. I got a little cake for my mom because it's her birthday so I just had them right. So I just had them right happy birthday on the cake and I'm heading home so that I can go spend her birthday with her. It was such a nice day. Honestly, I had the best time. I am so happy that Caitlin invited me out to go with them today because it was definitely a beach day. It was like 90 degrees, so perfect beach day. And we had the best time. We went for a few hours, hung out, and now I am back in Westchester ready to shower <laughs> and I also have work to do so I'm gonna probably just go home celebrate my mom's birthday have a slice cake and then um, do my work so I have a lot to do hi guys it is early I'm very tired it's 6 15 in the morning right now and I'm about to pull up to work but I had a really good time yesterday I met this guy who lives pretty close to my mom and he seems really nice and he's very very cute <laughs> now that that's like the end I'll be all but I am seeing him again on Thursday so it was really good it was really nice and 
yeah i'm excited but i need to get my life together and go teach right now and wake up because i am exhausted i'm so tired today and i have a long day today so i really need to get some coffee <laughs> I have not really vlogged today. I taught this morning and then came back here and had breakfast. I had some oatmeal and I've just been like lounging today. I'm really tired, really burnt out right now. Um, I was on the phone with my friend really late last night because she lives in LA and so it's like a three hour time difference. So she was up kind of late, um, you know, girl talk things. And so yeah, I'm kind of just making myself a quesadilla right now for lunch and I'm probably going to have that and honestly probably just chill and not do much until I have to work tonight because I am teaching tonight. So that's really my plan is just to have like a reset chill day today because I'm so tired like I literally can't do anything. <laughs> I'm heading to Greenwich today to teach and it's kind of gross out right now but it's supposed to be really nice out later so I think my mom and I are gonna go to um, this lake that's up a little ways and maybe go out on like a boat which would be really nice and maybe get lunch somewhere up there so I'm excited because today is my last day that I have to work. I have a couple days off, so I'm ready to have a little bit of a break because I am exhausted. I've been teaching so much and I love it, but I definitely need a little time <laughs> to chill out. home a little while ago uh, probably like an hour ago I got home around 7 15 but we had the best day it was so much fun the lake is beautiful it's gonna be like 20 minutes from where I'll be living so I'm excited about that and it's in a state park so they have so much to do like there's fishing there's camping there's hiking there's a campground right across the street from where we were today and it's pretty inexpensive to take the boats out which is nice um it was twenty dollars for two hours to take the rowboat out 
or the kayak out and if you want to go for longer than two hours it's only an extra five dollars and you can go for as long as you want they close at five so you have to have the boat back by five but you could technically spend like half a day or a full day out if you wanted to for $25 so really really good really fun and then we headed over to Billy Joe's in Newburgh which is a restaurant on the water it's so cute and it's funny because the first time I went I was with um, my like ex ex-boyfriend and he had a motorcycle and we decided to take the bike out and kind of ride upstate and stumbled upon this place a little bit by accident but the restaurant is like on a patio on the water they have cute little lights hanging and the docks are right next to it but they mostly serve ribs like that's what they're known for so I brought my mom I had to bring my mom she loves all that kind of food she grew up in the Midwest so she's like really into pulled pork really into barbecue and she said the food was really good so I'm happy that I got to bring her there and she got to experience it they also have a ton of vegetarian friendly options too they're really nice about like accommodating your food allergies food restrictions things like that and the service is so good like everyone who works there is amazing so I've never had a bad experience but I think I'm going to probably end the vlog off here. Tomorrow I'm going on a second date with the guy that I mentioned a little earlier in the vlog. And we actually have two dates planned. But one is tomorrow. We're going to see a band that's playing outside. It's a cover band. And we're going to do like a little picnic dinner. So he's picking up sushi and we're gonna put out a blanket and just kind of sit and wait for the band to start i'm gonna grab drinks for us and it should just be really nice and chill and fun and i'm excited so i'm feeling really grateful and loved and supported and just in such a good place like I feel like I have so many good things that are happening and so many amazing opportunities and it just feels like my life is just becoming everything I've ever wanted and manifested for myself and that's just like a really amazing feeling I'm going to say goodnight <laughs> watch a movie edit this vlog to get up for you guys I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you in the next vlog. There will probably be a Brimfield vlog either next or in two vlogs. Because we're leaving on Wednesday. Which is wild. That like came up so quick. Thank you so much for watching. I love you. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.